Hey guys, what is going on? It is Geo from Guns and Picks, and today I will be showing you how to install Optic Run for Minecraft for 1.0.0 again, because a lot of there have been a lot of uh, comments posted on my video saying that they keep getting black screens or their worlds have been deleted. Uh, about the worlds being deleted, I don't even know where that comes from. Um, honestly, I really don't. But first thing, before you even do anything, I want to say to you: open up your Minecraft, and then all you gotta do is click Options, Force Update, then Done. And then log in. Then it will give you a brand new Minecraft. Um, so that means this mic your Minecraft will have no more mods, just in case you have any old mods that you didn't you don't use anymore. But I need you guys to um, to update your Minecraft, mainly just re uh, refresh it so it's brand new, like if it was brand new out of the box or something. <laughs> or just to prove to you guys that I don't have Optifine. Look at this, only limited options right here. Okay, this is default options. All right, now I want you guys to close your Minecraft. Big thing, close your Minecraft. Alright, now this link will be in the description. All you gotta do is go to the first one that has the sun on it and click download one. It's imp simple enough, alright? And then uh, your download link will be right here. As soon as it's ready, all you gotta do is click it and it's preparing right here. See? Click it once, uh, left click it. <laughs> I'm making this so simple for you guys so you guys won't get confused. So click it and if you're using Google Chrome like I am, all you gotta do is drag that folder uh, file out. But if you're using uh not if you're using uh, uh Internet Explorer, it's all it's just gonna be in your downloads, all right? And just drag that file onto your desktop. All right, I recommend that you back up your bin just in case you get a black screen. I'm not saying you will, but just in case you did something wrong. All right. So after you after that's after this file is inside uh on your desktop, you go to your start menu, go to your profile name which is right here, and click organize, folder and search options, view. And click show hidden files, folders, and drives. Click apply and OK. Now, all this really does is make it uh, so that your app data is right here. And so that way you don't have to type run then percent app data percent because that shit is annoying. I hate doing that over and over again. So this just makes it so it's always here. So all you got to do is open that up, click roaming, click dot Minecraft, and open up your bin. Now, if you if you did that force update, there should only be one uh, Minecraft. And all you gotta do is open that with Renoir or 7-Zip. Uh, if you don't know how to install 7-Zip or Renoir, YouTube it. All I gotta say, YouTube it. All right, since all right, we opened this up with Renoir, since it's one of the simplest uh, programs to do it with. All right, so now you see there's a Meta Inf right here, Meta INF. This folder right here, we got to delete that. Uh, just just right click it and delete files. Are you sure you want to delete Meta? Inf? That is a yes, Commander. <laughs> that is a yes, cause it will give you a black screen now. Don't delete anything else. Don't touch anything else. Now, all you got to do is open up your uh, Optifine. And just in case, just make a new folder on your desktop. Just do not have to call anything. Click Control A and don't click the first one that has the dot dot because that's useless. And uh, just drag this onto your new folder. And then open up your new folder. Click Control A and just drag it onto your dot Minecraft. I mean, your dot jar for your Minecraft. And you should be done. Uh, simple enough. No, there should be no problems. This doesn't have. This doesn't even involve any of your world. Like I said, just in case you get a black screen, uh, make sure you back up your bin. My bin is backed up right here with all my mods in it, including Optifine. Now, uh, if you get a black screen, I don't know what to say to you. Uh, I pre I did everything right, cause I excuse me here. I have tons of new options. Um, I'm just. I don't know. You must have done something wrong. I'm I'm not saying it's your f I guess I'm saying it is your fault but I don't know what you did wrong but yeah like, um I have a I have a video explaining all the new uh the best options and whatever I'm just rambling on now but anyways thank you guys for watching I hope this cleared up any confusion and as always peace out